Today we're doing Lunchable S'mores Dippers, Honey Graham Sticks, Milk Chocolate Chips, and Marshmallow Cream. 250 calories per pack. Here's what we're dealing with. Yep, they're chocolate chips. Whoops. Yep, they're chocolate chips. They look like mouse pellets. Oh, what happened to your finger? And then the marshmallow cream. Hey guys, what's up? I'm Mr. Anime, and he's Emo Phillips. Together, we're Mr. Happy 0121. Welcome to the broadcast. That's not right, man. What? You don't like Emo Phillips? <laughs> he was very funny in the 80s. Yeah, that that's... Yeah, Emo, Emo Phillips. That's Emo what I, Phillips? Yeah, that's what, that's what I'm protesting here. Emo Phillips. Are you protesting Mr. Anime? No, no. Well, good. You better not, because he's making plans. Anyway, it's pretty dark. We're going to break right into the s'mores dippers. We, we're not going to waste any time. We've already opened the package. Buck a piece for these. Are you ready? I'm ready. Dipping it in the marshmallow. You know there's a strange deja vu about this. I feel like we've done this before. And no, I'm not talking about the gummy worm portion of this either. I'm going ahead without you, buddy. Oh, you ready? I'm ready. How many will he drop before they make it in his mouth? I'm going to go the real route. You should put the chips into the cream. When we did the um, gummy worms, the, what was it, dirt cake, <laughs> I had several people say, you know, you're supposed to just go ahead and put the uh, cookie crumbs into the marshmallow gunk. I did know that. Okay, my chips are now into my marshmallow gook. Let's try again. And one, and two. He got a bunch. One more and I'm ready to grade. This guy. Yeah, look at that. Da, da, da. Not one of his chips hit the ground. I'm super impressed. Now he had to... Hold it over this, but nothing fell to the ground. I was amazed. Do you want to go first on the grading? We'll go first. What do you give it? This is delightful. It's an A+. Plus. I, I, really, I really do like it. I'm really surprised by that because um, as of late, when one of us likes something, the other one's like, eh, C. I'm amazed. I really did like this. I'm going to give it an A. Uh, this was everything that the dirt cake was not. The... Marshmallow fluff for this worked better than it did with the worms. You know you can actually buy like jars of that, right? Yeah. Yeah. Marshmallow fluff. You're talking to a fat guy. I know all the ways you oh. can buy marshmallow fluff. An A and an A plus. Uh, for these cost one buck a piece a dollar. I would say a De Niro, but that's not really accurate. A dollar. You get, you know, a pretty good snack here. And it is delightful. Two A's. Two A's. Well done, Lunchables. About time you got your, your stuff straight because, you know, as of late, you've been kind of sliding. Been lacking. Yeah, that walking taco. See the review here. Not great. In fact, nothing should ever be called a walking taco. <laughs> Insert joke here. It's a Wednesday review, so we're not going to keep you long. We know midweek you got lots of stuff to do. Oh, yeah. Work stuff, school stuff, sleep stuff, watch TV stuff. So we're going to give a quick shout out, and then we're going to go on down the road. Today's shout out goes to our good friend Dominic Medley. Dominic Medley actually got very lucky in a sense because he asked just a few days ago, hey, how about one of them shout outs I've been hearing so much about? Oh. Well, we've got two lists. We've got the list that we always work off of, and then we've got the new list that we add to. I uh, can't find the other list, so Dominic jumped the line. Oh, good for him. Sorry, Dominic. Well, why am I sorry, Dominic? I'm sorry, everyone else. I let you down. Dominic, cut line on you. If we were at a club, he would be that guy that just goes around to everyone and they open up the ropes for him and he gets oh. right in the club. The Hate club. those guys. Lucky you, Dominic. 
I hope you enjoy this moment because your day's coming, buddy. There won't be any other line that cutting like, for that you. That sounded like a threat. It did, didn't it? Yeah. Well, you know. Careful when you start your car, Dominic. What do you expect from Mr. Anime? That's so sinister. I'm planning something. I'll let you in on a secret. Um, well, I'll let everybody else in on a secret. Oh. Uh, we filmed a video yesterday. We did the Arby's A1 steak. Uh, was processing it, and guess what? What? Malfunction. Malfunction? Uh, the camera. This is what happens when we choose to make videos without a director occasionally or someone behind the camera. I go to put it in, and the video would do extreme close-ups and then wide shots. Oh. Close-ups, wide shots. Close-ups, wide shots for like eight minutes. That's cool. So that one's going in the vault. But a couple things we talked about in that video. Uh, not going to be a lot of videos coming from us this weekend. Somebody's going to see Breaking Benjamin. Someone at this table. And someone at this table hates Breaking Benjamin. Leave it to you to guess which one of us has horrible music taste and which one of us is awesome. That's Your guess is yeah. as good as mine on that. Breaking Benjamin's awesome. There's a bunch of it's a dude screaming into a microphone and some guy smacking a, a guitar. It's horrible. It's like a lobot I'd rather have a lobotomy and listen to that. I'm serious. Well, that lasted a long time. Okay, there you go. Breaking Benjamin. I don't know. I, I'm convinced that maybe someone in Breaking Benjamin like beat him up, took his lunch money, or stole his girlfriend at some point. Because nope, he seems nope. to have an illogical hatred of just, Breaking Benjamin. Just heard them once, and that's all it took. Like, most people aren't even aware of who they are, good, except for good me. For them. I, I say they're awesome. And all the people that got better seats than me at this concert apparently <laughs> know who they are. But other than that, you know, I didn't know they had that big of a... you got to be pretty good or pretty big to have that much hatred. So give it up for Breaking Benjamin. Long story short, uh, we'll probably only make a couple more videos this week because I won't have a voice. <laughs> because I will be there cheering for them. All right. I'll be cheering wildly. Have, have fun. Oh, uh, yeah. And also, that show is going to be Shinedown, but... Uh, Shinedown's way better than uh, yeah, Breaking Benjamin. They're all right. Shinedown is okay. My face itches, I'm sorry. They're, like, pretty good. Did I did I stress you out so much by yeah, just saying yeah. they're okay? Yeah, you did. Yeah, I mean, you know, they're they're average. They're, like, I don't know, chocolate milk good. What's that one song they have that's a hit? Uh, they've got several hits. Oh. But, you know, Nickelback has hits, too. That doesn't mean, that doesn't really mean anything. You don't like Nickelback? No. Oh. <laughs> no, I don't. Not really. Man. I got off track there. We were going to do our whole goodbye, and uh, we'll see you in a couple days. But, guess what? On the other channel... Mr. Dark, 0121, taking the nation by storm, now up to 1,213 subscribers. 1,213 subscribers. Tomorrow, we have a brand new review, and I've excommunicated you from the seat for that one. Ousted me. Megan's sitting in, and she's damn excited to be here. And she likes Breaking Benjamin. So tomorrow, we're going to get together and enjoy a holiday something talk about breaking benjamin maybe not but we're gonna enjoy a holiday something so we'll see you there tomorrow as always thanks for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe here and over there put us on your white list you can find us on all social media mr happy 0121 we won't go into all of them today just check us out on instagram that's good enough for now or facebook or google plus we're not gonna get into all of them or snapchat you know some of them there's a few. Until next time, stay vigilant. Anything to add? You good? You just gonna sit here like a little elf and eat your crap? <laughs> yeah. That's really disgusting right there. What? Oh. It's way better than it looks. The... <laughs> This on a stick looks like your cat uh, didn't finish cleaning themselves when they came out of the litter box. Oh, wow. You ever see a cat with dingleberries? Nope. It kind of resembles this right here.